hello friends welcome back to another video tutorial in revit i am architect sonurai from glad studio and in this today video tutorial i am going to discuss with you an issue which we face in revit where, while creating our sheets when i am going to uh, change the scale in this sheet here you can see here this sheet and when i am going to select any view here and can uh, change the scale here so we can go to any floor plan here and when i am going to try to change the scale it is showing in dimmed here so why this is happening i am not able to select any scales and this will frustrate your situation in the revit so how to remove this uh, dimmed scale here i want to change the scale but i am not able to do so why this is happening this is happening so we'll go to the root cause here and you can find this a uh, solution on autodex website so you can see here unable to change view scale or other view settings in revit so what is the issue when trying to change the scale of a view or other settings like detail level the settings are deemed and inaccessible so you can see this is the issue which i am facing here and causes can be a view template controlling the scale is applied to the view so what is the solution remove view template to confirm that view template is causing the settings to be dimmed remove the view template from the view so you can disassociate the view from the template so i'm going to tell you how you can disassociate so you can see here i'm not able to select any of these skill this is showing in dimmed so i'm going to uh, view template here in my properties palette here and i can look for view template here so you can see here this is the view template and it is architectural uh, structural framing plan is selected so you are required to make it none and apply okay and now you can see this view template is none here and now you can select the scale you can see you can change to any scale here and it is now not in dimmed you can easily change the scale here you can change to your desired scale so this is the tutorial for the today session in the next session i will come with some more interesting topics in revit so thanks for watching bye bye